This is the first video in a series of how to print barcode labels for standard time for time tracking. Um, you've probably been introduced to the idea that standard time can support barcode scanners to start and stop a timer, usually for assembly line, manufacturing, uh, employee jobs, those sorts of things. Scan a label to start and then scan again to stop. But you might be asking, well, how do I print out those barcode labels? I mean, where do they come from? Uh, what do I print? Uh, how do I print them out? So the first way, the simplest way, is just to use Microsoft Word, and that is the topic of this video. There are other ways. You can use a little app called Barcode Builder that comes with Standard Time, and there is a little report in Standard Time. Now you may also have the barcode labels pre-printed somewhere else, but um, this video goes into discussing how to use Microsoft Word as just one of the many ways to get them printed out. So if we take a look here, you see the final results of what this might look like. Now I've just printed out some labels just pretty much randomly on this page to show that you that you have the flexibility of putting labels anywhere you like. I've got some usernames here which you have to scan so that you know which employee is, is logging the time. You've got um, what looks to be a category here, a couple of categories, tasks, projects, um, and then down at the bottom here you have something else that you'll probably want to um, make a label for, and that is stop or clear. You'll find that those are handy in the scanning. So anyway, let's get into how to use Microsoft Word to print barcode labels. So if you look over on the screen here, we can go ahead and get started. So I've switched over to Microsoft Word and you can see the same labels that we saw on the page there on this and the reason I'm showing you this is because I'm just uh, wanting to point out that you can use Microsoft Word to put the labels anywhere you want on a page. You have the flexibility of laying out the page anywhere you like or putting them on a work order or anything you like. So basically this is just ordinary text. So if I select this and go up to the font drop down and you know pick a font, you can see that that is just normal text. And all I've done is gone here to the font drop down, you scroll down, into the eyes because there's a font called ID Automation and I simply chose that and that turns that normal text into a barcode font and you just choose file print to print it out. Go look here at the font dialog you can see that the font name is ID Automation HC39M there's a link on the website to download that so go ahead and feel free to put labels anywhere you like on your work orders or use label templates to print them out uh, of course there are some other tools that you could use as well there's a little app called barcode builder there is a report in standard time you could use so a variety of ways to uh, get those printed out so let's go ahead and take a look at the font starting at the download so I switched over to the downloads folder and this is just the file that you would download and you can simply double click on that and this window will open and that shows you the font and then you can click install so once you've installed it then it's useful for any program that you want to use including Microsoft Word, the barcode builder, the standard time report, any application program that uses this font can print out barcode labels so we switch over to Microsoft Word and here they are again now I will just take a quick detour into standard time and show you what you'll be printing. That's not really the purpose of this uh, video, but I, I wanted to just show this quickly. So I've switched over to the standard time application and you see some projects here on the timesheet. You will probably start by scanning usernames. So if you go to the tools menu, choose users and organization, you see usernames here, you will print out barcode labels for those. You can go to the tools menu, choose projects, you see projects here, you will have to scan your projects, likely. There are certain ways to set up standard time so that you can go past that, but uh, that is one thing that you may have to do. Another thing might be going to tools categories and printing out barcode labels for categories or using project tasks. 
So a lot of things that you can scan in standard time. You'll have to consult some of the other videos for that. But I wanted to just point out that these are the areas you'll be going into when you're deciding what to print out. But really the focus of this video is using Microsoft Word as one of the ways, one of the many ways to print out those barcode labels. So hopefully that helps and uh, let us know if you need any uh, additional help with that.